Do you guys remember what margin is? What's the difference between margin and padding? What about the two? So here's your element. Uh, you have this something on this side, and then something in the inside. So which one's margin and which one's padding? Yeah. Padding is inside the Yeah, padding is inside. And then which one's margin? Margin. <laughs>
top right, it'll stay there, and the rest of it on the left will cut, get cut off, which is what you want. Does that make sense? Because the left part is ha like how you design how you design like the rest of the left most part of the right image is you make it like kind of like repeating. So um, if you cut off like up to here, it doesn't matter. It looks exactly the same as over here. So you don't. So it's kind of seamless.
So why is it a fixed layout? Yeah. So you can see like this kind of this section, it's not changing. If you so obviously it's not like 80% because if you make it really big, there's like more space on the sides. If you make it really small, it's still that size. Just the margin gets smaller. So this is exactly what you were talking about before, right? So something fixed like something in the middle, but it's fixed width, and the sides are um, the sides are auto create or auto calculated. And you can notice that if you go too small, you get this kind of nasty little horizontal slope up. And sometimes you can't avoid that. Like sometimes you're like you have images and they have to be that size and like you can't make an image like you don't want the image to be super small, so you set it to be a specific length. Does that make sense? Yeah.